Weather. I know. Today we're headed to the Great Barrier Reef. First stop at Lady Elliot Island. Essentially, there are about 200,000 birds on this island and it's a combination of organic concrete of sorts between bird poop and calcification of algae or, or, or public poop. and coral poop basically it's and it's big and natural and beautiful. <laughs> In the middle of the Pacific, there are entire nations that exist like this, right? And the reefs provide a barrier to the ocean swell. Without those reefs, the islands would just get washed away. So we're going shot by shot, and it is a hot day here on Lady Elliot Island. Hop in. Andreas just drove us across the island, and it took approximately Baby. two minus 45 seconds. Yeah. A half a million birds right now, apparently, because they just have babies and they're everywhere. I'm just making up facts as we go, but these guys actually know what's up. There is this kind of idea, especially in America, where we're very far away, and you know, you see these headlines saying the Great Barrier Reef is dead. That's not necessarily entirely true. All hope is not lost yet. It's still big and beautiful and diverse and rich with life. They're just areas that have okay. suffered serious damage, particularly the last summer. Mm. Um, the coral bleaching event here caused a lot of damage to corals up in the far north. You know, people switching off lights in America, you know, being more energy conscious, that will help save the reef. We gotta wrap it up. Go do another shot. Thank you guys. So now we're going on the boat, which is like a dream come true because we're gonna actually yeah. go see the Great Barrier Reef. Yay! We're on a boat. Oh, what? Normally, when you see pictures of coral reefs, you see all these vibrant reds and yellows and oranges and purples. The, the, a healthy coral is a dull browny green colour because that's telling you it's got lots of those little single cell plants living inside it that give it all its energy. So, this sort of more drab colour is actually a really healthy reef. Look how big this guy is. Yeah, I mean, that is. I mean, that's huge. How old do you think that piece of Well, that's, that still would be one of the fast growing ones. That's a plate, so that could be 15 years 15 old. Years old that's I think. it? Yeah. Just got out of the water and Richard is the coolest. He had his underwater camera. Ah! So we saw a male green, a female green, and a hawk's bill. So that's pretty cool. This is the coolest thing ever. That was so beautiful. I can't imagine how people can ignore the fact that we need to preserve that and protect that for future generations for bazillions of years to come to be able to enjoy and appreciate the Great Barrier Reef. I'm speechless, that was amazing.